Roar! Yeah! <laughs> I got you. Yeah. <laughs>video I showed you these I showed you my favorite thing of this and tell you about all of my nursing clothes and all the things that you need for nursing I just showed you guys and I'll have that video I don't know when I'll have that video hopefully it'll be up soon I don't know what do you guys think so with having our daily vlogs which we upload every single day what we do every day in our daily vlogs and then I have lots of videos now that I've done as far as my labor and delivery video, our, up, our one week updates, and now the nursing video, and I'm going to get to her nursery tour video and diaper bag video once my diaper bag gets in um, to show you guys. So yeah, what do you, let me know below in the comments, what do you think? Should I try to upload two videos a day or should I try to squeeze in those videos like every couple of days in between our daily vlogs? Um, but then we'll get behind on some daily vlogs. So I don't know, or should I just try to, cause I have a lot of time right now to get to like videos and editing while I'm at home. So that's why I wanna try to get some of these videos for you guys before I get back to the salon and get like busy and just crazy. So, and cause a lot of these videos we, as far as like nursery tour and what's in our diaper bag and um, what's in our hospital bag, I did that one too. You guys in more like for C-section and stuff, what I needed. Yeah, so I just don't know how I should upload them all probably just upload maybe um have to upload those in the daily vlog too in the same day for a little while i don't know let me know what y'all think but anyway so today we are um getting out of the house again i've got to go to my two week doctor checkup i take claire bear tomorrow to hers um but today so me and mom we're gonna go to lunch while i'm out i might as well get ready and also i'm gonna go to lunch go to that and i gotta meet my dad at our new business to check on a couple talk about a couple of things for that and then I'll be back home and we're doing pictures tomorrow morning so I gotta get ready for that and also I'll see you guys soon. Hey, good morning. Good morning guys. <laughs> you might want to come right now if you're awake. Well, but this is tasty. Well and, and, and you could tasty. see any and you could see your old hand. Huh? And your old hand. Huh? Bands, whatever. Oh. Something. Oh, no. Not not old in the mean fans. Oh, I don't know. Me... I don't know what I'm saying right now. But we whoa, whoa, whoa. careful, 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 careful. I'll cut it, cut it. But guys. Let me cut it. Some color. Okay, get your knife. Get your knife. Guys? I'll hold it. No, you cut it. There you go. No, nope. cut it right there. Alright, so me half of my girls are here and the other half are at home trying to get some rest. And we'll be doing this a lot. Uh in the foreseeable future. So, um, look, at me, look at me, look at my backup. So we're going to eat up good. What's that, Daddy? And then we're going to go play. Yeah. And then we have a doctor's appointment for Camry later on yeah. in the day. Yeah. Hope everything goes good. We can put all that behind us and just love on her, right? You were loving on her last night, weren't you? I you woke up so I could sleep with Camry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Feel the excitement. Really awesome. It was really cool to have her. We felt complete. I felt complete. Mm -hmm. Roar! <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Good girl. I want ice cream. What? It is breakfast time, girl. They don't have ice cream for breakfast. I want ice cream though. Just these kids nowadays thinking Chick-fil-A equals ice cream, but on my watch. Oh. You can do it. You can do it. I trust. I know you can. Yes, you did it. You're such a big girl. All right. Be careful though. Oh wow. Wow. You're trying to scare me. Are you trying to scare me, Claire? All right, guys. So we went and ate lunch, and now I'm at the doctor's. Okay.
cannot believe it's been two weeks already guys that's so crazy and it feels really weird to drive up here my mom drove us to lunch and then she to get back to Salante but I'm just like right here near here so I drove here and it just feels really weird to drive after not driving for two weeks that's really crazy and Camry I fed her while we were eating lunch like I was feeding her she was eating on this one I was able to eat at the same time that was really weird but I did it I remember doing that with Claire a lot. So yeah, so I'm here for my checkup. So hopefully it goes good. And then I gotta go meet my dad. But it's just so weird. I cannot believe it's been two weeks. That's crazy. She is two tonight. Well, Friday morning, early in the morning. She will be two weeks old. That's so crazy already. And I'm gonna check on her wake tomorrow and see how she's doing. But this is just so so I'm going to see the doctor I saw when I first was at King and then they had to transport me so we'll probably be talking about like how great how the crazy of events it's like of course I can't just go to the hospital and have a baby regularly I have to have this crazy story and all that went on with having Camry so I thought every time I've had like this crazy story like Kinsley she was head down but she was like turned the wrong way so to turn her so hers was crazy in that aspect because I had to push forever with her head down but just she was turned the opposite way head down and then Claire's was so crazy because I was planning on getting epidural and everything and it just happened in so fast and I have her with no epidural or anything and then Camry I was planning on like every time I plan something it never goes how I plan it like ever so I should just go with the flow with that's usually how I am I just go with the flow whatever I don't let anything bother me normally it's just like you know if it's gonna happen and it's in God's plan then everything that's what's supposed to happen so there's no reason to worry about stuff because stuff is gonna work out just how it's supposed to and when things don't work out exactly the same way you can't worry about it so much sorry that lady was walking by really slow yeah you can't just worry about anything you just have to if it happens it happens and if stuff already happens then that's how it's supposed to be and you just gotta go from there so anyways but Camry's of course her story of having her all that whole craziness that happened with her so um with her being having she was actually flipped upside down she was breached and then had to flip her where Claire Kinsley was uh, head down she just flipped the opposite way but anyways I have all their stories on YouTube so if you want to go back and watch those videos but okay we're here now gotta get in here and then go see my dad and then I'll be ready to get back home well four hours into this and it ain't done that was not the best tool to get that up with I believe I don't know I uh, kind of described what I needed to do. They told me that. That's all I can, you know, base it on. I've never done this before, but goodness gracious. I don't know if you can see all that. I mean, it is a ton of dust. Green dust. I was scraping up that green paint. Pieces that wouldn't come up and around the edges there. I don't know what to, to do now. I'll, I'll ask. Uh, father-in-law see what he says okay I'm at a red light but holy smokes I just looked at my face in the mirror oh my gosh I had a dust mask on the entire time too that's sad oh man I, I'm gonna be I don't know I look like the Green Lantern or something oh my goodness we're gonna get cleaned up well I totally forgot to film it all in the doctor's room oh my gosh I was gonna film like in the doctor's room just because but I totally forgot so but it went good they said my incision looked really good I can start driving now and said I could take the glue off of it I even realized I was gonna have to take the glue off of it but he like peeled off one side and I was like ah oh. it's like it's gonna be like taking a band-aid off he was like you might want to try to take it off in the shower and he said it was looking good so now I gotta go back in four weeks and that's pretty much it so now I'm here at the new place because we got to talk about some more stuff here as far as and then we're going to get back home. I'm ready, I'm sorry to get home and rest.
right, so that's the x-ray machine, this here, and I get that window. But this is too difficult for me, so I'm going to have uh, somebody professionally come out and get this. Because I don't want to screw it up. Okay, guys, we're home now. Just fed Camry again. I fed her when we were out to lunch, and then we did our running around and then so I showed y'all a little bit of the new place but it's really cool we got lots more going on now heat and air right now they're fixing the floors then the plumbers got to get out there and the electricians got to get out there the walls are up that y'all seen and then they have to finish the walls once everything else is done and then we have to paint everything which I thought was going to take a while so we've got a lot going on. We were hoping possibly to get in there in September, but I don't know. It might be October. But as long as everything is coming together, then just things are happening and we're seeing progress now. So that's really awesome. I love going up there and talking about what we need to do and all that kind of stuff. So I think we got some more situated today. Joel's still got to go back up there and meet a couple of the guys a few more times for things and... Yeah, but it's coming along, so it's really exciting. And it's just so crazy that we have this bit, all this business stuff going on. It's, it was cool to go up there and like be there when the guys are actually working on it, because you're actually seeing them like doing something on the place, so that's really cool. Yeah, but now it's just waiting for all this stuff to get done, and then we'll get in there eventually, but I'm excited once we we'll get in there and all will be really cool. So yeah, a couple of you guys had commented on her eating schedule and going back to work so soon so i wanted to address those for a second um she is eating often at night is the only time that i let her like just to get me like a little bit more sleep during the day i'm feeding her every about every three hours like i have to wake her up though like she's a very sleepy baby still and tomorrow we got to check on her weight so depending on what they say on her weight Hopefully she's gained weight. She really eats like a lot more now. She normally would only breastfeed for like 10, 15 minutes. She'll eat almost 30 minutes. And last night she ate for almost like 45 minutes. I was like, God, girl, she is just, and the other thing is she likes to stay on my boob. Like even when she's done eating, just as like a pacifier. And both the girls, when they were done eating, they would like, you know, stop eating altogether. I know they're, they're done. And her, she'll just like want to stay on my boob. And I'm like, I can tell that she's not eating anymore. She just like wants to stay on there. And if I try to like take her away from it, she's like, no. She wants it back like as far as like using it as a passy. So I think this girl is definitely going to love her passy. Maybe even more than the girls. And she may suck her thumb because she's been sucking her thumb a little bit too. And then um, as far as me going back to work, which she'll almost be within a couple days, she'll be four weeks old. And it'll be four weeks since I had her. So that's usually what I go back with the girls. And I know at a C-section this time, I've been able to rest more, a lot more now with um, having babysitters and being able to a lot of family help and babysit so that I can rest too and get naps in also when she's napping. But as far as me going back to work, it's not like, like my job isn't like, where I'm constantly doing something, like I'll be do, I'll like put a color on and I'll have like 30 minutes for the color process and I'll just be able to handle stuff with Camry or be able to sit down and rest and then cut their hair and then I'm done. Like, it's, it's, I'm not doing two colors together like I normally would do two colors together and be constantly busy, but now I'm just gonna be going back and just have a color here or there, a haircut here or there. I'm not like super, super busy or anything. I'm trying to spread people out. And I'm still gonna be taking off days. Like I'm only, when I first go back, I'm only working uh, right now, Tuesday, Friday, and Saturday. With that Wednesday and Thursday, I'm not working right now. So, but I could change, I may do a couple like in the morning or afternoon, but still have the morning or afternoon off or take the whole day off. Like I can really do my schedule like anyway. I would like to so um, I'm still gonna be taking days off or mornings or afternoons off I'm not gonna be like super crazy busy for like another month um, but definitely by October and depending on if we get into our new business is when we'll probably switch it up when she's around two to three months and she's such a good baby right now I really could probably keep her at the salon if she stayed you know I have to see how our situate 
our situation changes as she gets older. Sorry, my arm is getting tired. Tired and sorry, I thought like I'm talking Bill's head off again. I don't like to be like super talkative because I feel like you guys like to see more of like stuff that we're doing than trying to like explain stuff. But anyway, I have to see how our situation changes as she gets older and then with the new business and all that kind of stuff, how either she'll start staying with my grandma some, but either so i don't want my grandma to have to be keeping three kids so we've talked about it and either she's gonna she'll have claire all the time because claire is ms she is a little troublemaker and she's just her toddler self she's almost three and so probably when she gets older like kinsley she'll get easier as far as in that aspect and having her at the salon because kinsley i can have her at the salon she's actually helpful so i'm either gonna have kinsley me picking up kinsley from school and my grandma will have Claire and Camry, or if I have Camry at this time with me, then my grandma can pick up Kinsley like she was doing. She'll have Kinsley and Claire, but they have started to really aggravate each other and be sisters, and little Miss Claire just wants to aggravate Kinsley all the time, and so it's like, it's really easier just to have probably Claire and Camry than for Kinsley to be here. Claire aggravates Kinsley all the time, but I know that's how it is as far as brothers and sisters and as Claire's getting older and I know how me and my brother were when we were little we used to argue and just always aggravate each other and but now they're older we're like best friends we're really close that's how the girls are going to be too and they got her anyway so I'm talking your head off I'm about to go get a shower to get ready for our pictures in the morning so I'm gonna fix my hair and straighten it probably tonight because they're coming early in the morning at nine o'clock in the morning I'm probably gonna have to be up at like seven in the morning just to get ready and then be able to get the girls ready and Cammy ready and everybody because I'll have to feed her right before pictures and everything but I'm so excited about our pictures especially since we didn't get to do our maternity pictures I hope you can see me okay in here I really like like the sunlight I don't know I don't like having a bunch of lights on and stuff I just like the sunlight I'm just really excited for our pictures since we didn't get to do the maternity pictures I'm so glad that we're getting to do these newborn pictures I've never even done the newborn pictures with the girls either so this will be a new experience and I can't wait I think I'm really excited to get pictures of all three girls like together and I'm sure they'll have some really cool ideas but they're actually coming here instead of us going to a location or anything because I think it's even supposed to rain tomorrow it's like every time we try to do pictures it seems like it's supposed to rain so this will be so crazy to look back at these pictures as the girls get older like I, I think I'll just absolutely love having these pictures when Camry was a little baby and then as they grow up and I'm sure we'll have tons of pictures with all three of them together all of their life which is so crazy to think about but it's later and the girls are going to VBS again tonight so I really did get a great break today but I did have to do some running around so yeah Right. Open up, open up, open up. No, Just spit, 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 spit. Oh yeah. Look at that big spit. Open not up. Yet, not right now. It's bedtime. Hey, you gonna tell here. the guys what you got? What we're What'd getting? What you get today? No, tell tell the guys what, what we're getting. What do you mean? What, what are, are you we, getting? What are we getting out, Claire? Uh, two of their bugs. And the kabobs. And I did mine already. Yeah, we gotta brush your hair because we got we pictures in the early in the morning. We gotta get ready for early. pictures. I'm so excited. I probably won't be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> you have a baby. Well, a baby, and I'm just excited about pictures. The yeah, baby, look at the her baby. hair. Look, it looks just like yours. It's curling up. It's really? gonna be wavy. Yeah, look at it's it. It's gonna be wavy like me. It curls up. Yours curled like that when you were a baby. Me? Wow. Yeah. Me was a baby. Like that. Curls like a baby. But she's got dark hair like Claire, so it's gonna be. It's gonna be look. part of us. Yep, it's going to be a little bit darker like Claire's and be wavy like yours, I think. I mean, we have to wait till it gets longer, but I remember Kinsley's hey, doing that. Yes. I, just washed, I just gave her a little bath. Kinsley, come here. Oh, brush your hair. Get over here. So cute. So cute. I don't like I need a sip so of So cute, water. you're a baby. I'm going to get wild, guys. I'm not. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna get water on her eyes? Is that what she's saying? Mama, baby! The baby might be crying. Is she uh, looking at you? She's looking at that. <laughs> she's like, what Baby, are you why you do that, well, baby? <laughs> I can't baby, tell, mommy, I can't can tell this eye's gonna be clothing like she's gonna be like Ooh. wink. Booby, oh, really? booby, she booby, like, booby, booby. She's gonna be the first guy like me. Do I need to do the spray or something? I'm the other eye. 